Our ancestors, who lived alongside nature, used to worship not only trees, water, earth or fire. They used to consider stones as sacred as well. They used to know their spirit and believed they had extraordinary powers. Ordinary stones used to be split and used for household purposes, for laying foundations and paving paths. If you decide to split a sacred saint stone, you will not get away from disasters, most likely. Even at the moment of blowing up the sacred stone, looming on Rabinus Hill, one worker had his eye and arm badly injured, and all of those who were part of the works were crippled, and death awaited the managers themselves. The miller, Schwarkus, from the nearby village Badenai, had made grindstones out of the bigger part and placed it in his mill. Soon, and placed it in his mill. Soon, he'd grown poor, and one day he was found pulled into a gear and badly injured. Sacred thing it was, and it avenged for touching it this way. The stone of Jomantai managed to remain intact, as it was hiding underground a long time. The boulder was found and uncovered by the forester of the Sevillae forest, Jonas Kalvinskas, with the idea that people could admire the brother of Puntukas. The stone of Jamintai amazes by its length of 4.7 meters. Its height is even 2.58 meters, width 3.91 meters. The boulder looms in the village of Sevillae, Telshia district in Vaniai Regional Park, near the recreational path of Jamantai Forest. So, when you take a walk, do not simply pass by.